Ladies and gentlemen, this is Tyrone the Southern Kitchen back at you today with another video. All right, what we doing now here? We got some pig feet down here. We finna cook now. We'll give them a little rinse. Rinse, you know these, I say pig feet, so, you know, pigs, they feet got to be rinsed out real good. You know, that, that's how they ever walk in with mud. You want to make sure you got to rinse these over here out good. Don't trust that stuff coming from the stove. Do be your own rinsing. Yes, It'll be gone rinsing. Yes, sir. Go ahead and put them in our little pot. Huh? Go ahead and add some water to it. Just go over here. What we gonna do? We're going to let these have boil, boil one good time and see how much red's going to come off the top of these. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I'll show you what I'm talking about. We got to go on the other side. Hope everybody's doing fine today. All right, I ain't going to put nothing in this pot right now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to let it boil. And see how much foam and stuff come up to the top. And see how then if that come up to the top, then what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull that off. I'm going to change my water out. Rinse it off again. Then I'm going to put some more water in there. And then I'm going to let it boil again. And if it do the same thing, we're going to do it again. But we don't want all that foam and all that, 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 that whatever that is. I don't want all that on my meat. So that's how we're going to do it. Then after we... Let it boil for a little while. After we get all that situated and come back with some clean water and start letting it cook a little while, then we're going to come along and put our onions and bell peppers and all that other stuff in it. We don't never do our, put our onions and stuff in there when we first start putting uh, cooking our meat and stuff like that. Sometimes I do, but I always going to have another batch to come behind it because I still want to taste I still want to taste the onion and bell pepper flavors in my food. So you can start cooking it. When you first start cooking, I mean, you're going to be no, I mean, hey, because you're going to have to add more water to it and all that kind of stuff as well. Depends on whatever type of meat you're cooking. But anyway, enough from all that wrapping. Stay tuned. See all that foam and stuff right there? That's the kind of stuff I don't want on my meat. So I have to rinse that off. Foam stuff right there. Nah, we ain't having that. We ain't having that, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, we're gonna try it again. It all the water spilled out all over my stove. I got my stove. Now I gotta, gotta clean my stove when it get through cooking this right here. I get it off of there. Y'all stay tuned. We're going to see how this going to roll. All right. Let's see what we got going on here. What I'm going to do. Still got a lot of little foam in there. What I'm going to do. I'm going to rinse this off one more time. Put some more water in it. Then I'm going to let it go ahead and start cooking. That's what I'm going to do. I don't like all that foam stuff there. That's what I'm gonna do. Pour off all that foam. All right, Actually, there ain't really none on it. So I can go ahead and let that cook. That's good, though. Yeah. That's good, though. Yeah. So I just let this thing cook for about a, a good hour, maybe an hour and 25 minutes, and then I start putting my seasoning, onions, and bell peppers and stuff in it. 
Got him boiling pretty good. Got him boiling pretty good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Please keep me that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you see the water don't cook down on this young quite a bit. What we're going to do now, we're going to go ahead and add our uh, vegetables and stuff in here as well. Got another Add some more water to that. I'm also going to add some onions to that. And then we're also going to add some bell pepper to this. I'm using bell pepper. So we're gonna add a little, a little salt with this. Also we're gonna add a little garlic powder with this. Also we're gonna add a little onion powder with this. Then now what we're gonna do, we're gonna Push all that down into the meat. Just like that there. Like that there. Push it on down. Just like that there. Might add a little bit more water to it. enough water. I'm going to let this uncook cook down. Smell the season now. Smell all that good season in it now. I got a cleaning to do on this stove when I get, get through. Yep, that's what we're doing now. So it don't cook for about an hour and 20 minutes. Maybe it might be a little longer than that. So what we're going to do now, we're going to uh, let it cook for another, another maybe an hour or so. We'll know when it get tender. We'll know when, that, when, it, when, it's, when, it, when they are through, when the, when the meat start coming off the bone. That's when we know they are through. So we're going to let them boil over a little bit more. Keep on boiling. Not boil over, but I don't want it to boil over. I want it to stay in the pot. Well, we're finna check them out, see what's going on. They ain't quite done yet. Still kind of rubbery. Rubbish. They ain't quite done yet. Shit, they ain't sticking to the bottom of the pot. Bring them some, some of them to the bottom, to the top. On the bottom to get to the, the ones at the bottom are good. Yeah, let's see what's going on. Let's yeah, see what's going on. Yep, let's see what's going on, everybody. And just a little bit more of this water here. By the time I come back, they should be ready to go. All right. See like they about there. Yeah, 
they just about done. They should be, I'll tell you the truth. So what we got going on? Yep, they got. Yep, they do. They do. All right. Go ahead and turn this off. Turn that on. Turn that off. All right. Stove messed up, boy. I got a cleaning to do on this stove, boy. Yes, sir. I got a cleaning to do on this stove. Well, here, ladies and gentlemen, my pig feet is done. Been on the stove for about three hours, three hours, about 20 minutes. That's what we got there going on right there. Yep, that's what we got going on, ladies and gentlemen. She kind of bring it closer. Three hours and 20 minutes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, like the video, subscribe to the channel, put a thumbs up, ring the bell for you to be notified. And everybody have a blessed day. Peace out.